did. <laughs> Hello, everyone. Oh, it's Carolyn. Hi. I think. <laughs> Bash my head. <laughs> Jesus Christ. You're right. Yeah. Bloody rubbish at this. Hello, everyone. Hi. I, ho I hope you can see me. Us. Us. <laughs> um, so, it's bloody freezing in here. I know. <laughs> and as we say in, in this part of Suffolk, the wind is a gusting. Yeah. Isn't it? Yeah. It That's is. bloody blowing in it, but can we say that on camera? I don't know. <laughs> well, I, I think now. so. <laughs> it doesn't matter. We should, do, should, we, should, we, should we put like a PG 18? What, if we're just saying bloody? Well, you know how it is these days, don't you? you know. God. Can't say anything these days. <laughs> hey everyone, how are you all doing? Um, welcome to Caravan Chit Chat. Now, today's little video is we have some exciting news. We do indeed. Drum roll. <laughs> <laughs> um, basically, our news is um, as you saw in our uh, video in January when we discussed what it is we've got planned for this year. And we did uh, mention in there that we've got a rather large trip coming up in uh, April yeah. and a little surprise to go with it. So basically that surprise is that we are very, very, very lucky enough to be um, using a Bailey motorhome. Dun, dun, dun. Oh, everyone's groaning, not another Bailey bloody person dead having a Bailey freebie and not all the rest of it. Not another blogger, vlogger person group getting a Bailey, blah, yeah. blah, blah, blah. Now, um, we just want to say right from the word go, we never intended to go out, uh, we never intended to, to get a, 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 um, a free motorhome or anything like that. It, it just wasn't our intention. We didn't think we were nowhere near sort of professional enough to, to um, be, you know, to get this opportunity. We're not. Um, no, we're not. How have we actually done it? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> um, basically, I contacted Bailey about hiring a motorhome um, and the, the conversation went on from there. So, uh, and obviously when I say hiring a motorhome, I was going to pay, we were going to pay yeah, whatever, we whatever gonna price. Yeah, we were going to pay to hire one. Um, and they were, you know, say, you know, they just said, well, we do have a media marketing department. Um, there may be an opportunity that we'd be, you know, able to loan you one. Mm -hmm. And you were a bit hesitant. What are you looking at my head for? Oh, I was just seeing if you cut yourself. Oh. Um, you <laughs> distracted me. You were a bit hesitant, weren't you? And I sort of thought, it's a once in a lifetime opportunity um, to try a motorhome. I really, really want a motorhome. Um, whereas you not so much you're more it's uh, still um, in love with the caravan which I do I love the caravan yeah I'm definitely but, more caravan um, orientated I really 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 want us to get a motorhome don't I and um, I was kind of pushing for us to try this uh, you know just so that we could um, have the opportunity to see what it's like and what it's you know all the pros and the cons um, and yeah, just from a caravaner's point of view, what it's like to have a motorhome. Exactly that. So, yeah, as Vicky said, basically, um, well, we, we yeah, we, we've just been given this opportunity. Um, I have, I've, I've been very hesitant to, um, to agree to it purely because obviously we have got to tweet about Bailey Motorhomes. We've got to post some pictures, all that sort of thing. Uh, and it's not really something that I'm um, uh, totally okay with in terms of, you know, with, with, with everything we've done so far on our on our vlogs and Twitter, we've never advertised or, or um, received any kind of benefit in any which way or form of advertising anything we've done or used or anything like we've that. We've never ever been sent anything. Or never been sent paid anything. For anything. Yeah, we, we've. we've um, just, and this is the first time. Yeah. You know, but. To be fair to Bailey, uh, they've been kind enough to give us this opportunity, yeah. and w they do obviously want something out of it. You know, it's it's for them. It's advertising for them, isn't it? it you is, know, yeah. that's that's why they do it. That's why they lend these um, 
uh, outfits to vloggers like us and yeah. other people that have done it. Say, well, I don't know. We're just, kind of. We're just a couple of numpties who just put some videos on YouTube. We ain't no yeah, vlogger, but, but we still, you know, have a following that may be interested in um, getting a Bailey or um, looking into a motorhome, you know. So we've got to kind of look at it from that point of view, really. What are you laughing at? Nothing. <laughs> um, yeah, totally. Wow. <laughs> uh, yeah, so as, I, as we said, you know, it is not something we're entirely comfortable with in terms of having You're to... You're not. Uh, yeah, me. In terms of having <laughs> to... I don't care. I really want to try it. In terms of like... No, I really want to try it, but I, I'm not so comfortable with advertising something. I can't and wait I, to drive it. Uh, and I know that um, with the... I know with the um, you know the, the caravans that people have been loaned um, in recent months, there has been a little bit of debate on Twitter um, about it. Uh, so we are very conscious of that. We really hope that that it's not going to turn anyone off our channel or anything like that. Um, like Vicky said, we we are literally it's an opportunity for us to sample a motorhome and. Uh, you know, try and realise the benefits compared to a caravan, or or, or the negatives. You know, um, which I'm sure there is. So the trip we're doing um, lends itself to a motorhome, doesn't yeah, it? Yeah, yeah. You know, so you, do, you wouldn't want to. Oh yeah, yeah You wouldn't want to tow a caravan up well, where we're going. We're going to talk about the trip. Oh, oh sorry. You know I mean? Go on then. <laughs> do you want to steal your thunder? Steal, steal your thunder. Um, Don't make me hurt you. Um, yeah, so basically a little bit about the trip now, isn't it? Yeah, go on then. You've been itching to tell everyone, haven't you? Well, yeah, it's, the, it's like the best part, isn't it? <laughs> you know? Yeah. So basically, um, last year we decided to um, that this year we were going to go to Scotland. Um, well, I had the option, didn't I? You gave me the yeah, option. Yeah, actually, I gave Vicky the option. Of Scotland or France. Not that, not that you know... Not that I'm the boss and I, you know, no, I have to do whatever I want, but we just... Well, that was the point. You gave me the choice. Yeah, I gave you the choice. So, yeah. um, I chose Scotland because I really wanted to go to Scotland and we done France, not last year, the year before. Albeit not the South or anything. Like no, that, it but... wasn't the South, but it was kind of in the middle. It was still a blooming 13 hour drive. Yeah. But, yeah, so I chose Scotland <clears> and we were going to do it in the caravan. Yeah, we we were we booked um, the Bunry Caravan and Motorhome Club site, um, and our plan was basically to head up on the Friday, stop on the way up in uh, around the Lake District area, and stay at Bunry for a week, and then come back down again, stop on the way back down, and and that's the trip. Mm -hmm. With the um, with the the motorhome in mind. Um, what we have decided to do is make it into more of a tour. So now we collect the motorhome on the Friday. We're going to head uh, up to the Lake District area um, to the Caravan and Motorhome Club site at Kendall. Yeah. Uh, from there, which will then be the Saturday, we're going to head to Bunry. Mm -hmm. We're going to have a night in Bunry. Um, and then from there on the Sunday, we are planning to go to the Isle of Skye. Um, and stay on the UIG um, campsite, mm -hmm. and then on the Monday, after watching Mr. Andrew Ditton's um, various uh, videos of the Outer Hebrides, we've decided to go, go to, to the Outer Hebrides. <laughs> Shit, as band of all time. <laughs> So anyway, I really, really want to go to Harris of Tweed, yeah. or Tweed of Harris, whatever it's called. <laughs> What's it called? The Tweed of Harris, is that what well, it's called? Well, the Harris Tweed place. Just Harris Tweed? Isn't yeah, it? I really want to go there. Yeah, so basically, on the Monday, <laughs> we've booked on a uh, Calmac ferry, and we're heading... Is that what it's called? Caledon Caledonian McBrain, yeah. McBrain? McBrain. <laughs> My God. Sounds like something off a cartoon. Do you not like... <laughs> do you not McBrain. like... McBrain? McBrain, did you, do you not see that... <laughs> You not pay attention when we watch Andrew Ditton's no, video. No, I didn't. I didn't know it was called that. <laughs> what do you think it was called? Like Sea France or something? I don't know. Obviously not fucking Sea France. I can't say Sorry. that. <laughs> you have to bleep that out. I have to bleep that out. Let's take a language to the extreme. Sorry. Isn't it? 
Potty mouth. Um, yeah, so basically on the Monday, we booked the ferry to the Isle of Harris. And we are basically planning to wild camp in the Isle of Harris for three nights. Uh, and then we make our way back across again. Uh, and we stay an, a night again at Bunry on the way back. And a night around the Lake District on the way further south. And that is our trip. Nine days. Yes, nine days. So we're absolutely... Well, to be honest, it doesn't even seem real, does it? No. I'm starting to shiver now because it's... But you really haven't even really ever been to um, Scotland, have you, either? No, the only time I've been to Scotland was on a, um, in previous life of a self-employed... Previous life? Uh, as a it makes you sound like you've been reincarnated. Uh, I have. <laughs> as a self-employed courier, um, when I drove to Peterhead in one day. So that was and it. I've only been to the sort of other side, like um, Perth side, so it'll be... Good. You know, a new thing for both of us, won't it? It will, yeah. And obviously the, um, you know, like the Isle of Skye. I mean, we, it's, we, we've had a lot of influences, haven't we, on this on this planned trip. Um, Posh Cats camping, when they um, done their Scotland um, tour, which is yeah. you know, we, what we're doing is basing it quite, you know, on that quite a bit, obviously um, up to Skye. Um, yeah, lots of people, Andrew Ditton. And, Andrew uh, Ditton. We just love, like the inspiration from them those videos didn't yeah. we and i've been watching camper van um camper van capers yeah. recently um obviously they've been on the isle of sky recently as well Fuss and beyond went up there as well didn't they yeah um yeah they did yeah yeah, yeah. We, watched we watched um we watched them as well so yeah we've had quite a lot of uh influence um on inspiration inspiration influence. yeah yeah inspiration that's the word i'm looking for yeah inspiration sorry i had a lot of um a lot of beer last night. So. And wine. Um, yeah, I haven't quite woke up yet today. So, um, <laughs> yeah, um, a lot of uh, inspiration and we can't wait. No, we're really excited. Now, the motorhome um, that we are getting for the trip is um, a Bailey Advance and it will be familiar to um, a lot of you guys who have watched Bob Earnshaw's uh, recent trip in a, in a Bailey motorhome because I believe it is actually the same motorhome um, so yeah so if you've been watching uh, if you've been watching his videos uh, that is the one it's the 764T uh, with the um, two twin uh, the twin um, two twin twin beds you don't say two twin do you no, that's weird just twin um, yeah twin single fixed beds <laughs> which means I haven't got to share with Vicky Joke. Joke. No, it's fine. I'm not offended. <laughs> uh, and we just absolutely can't wait. It's just going to be so different to anything we're used to. Normally when we go away, we do tend to just go to one site, set up for a week, and that's it. Or yeah. for a long weekend, however long we're going for. Um, so, you know, this thing of, of, of travelling to another site, to another site, and obviously the wild camping element of it as well, so different to what we're used to mm. um, and we feel that we're really going to get the most out of the motorhome um, on a trip like that uh, we didn't think that if we just took it and went to one site for a week we didn't think it would really suit um, what we it would be use. a bit of a waste wouldn't it yeah if yeah. we only went to one place yeah because you know we, we like the fact well I, I certainly with the caravan i like the fact that when we go to one place we set the caravan up and we've got the car to, to go and do whatever we want to do. Mm. And we do go out quite a bit, don't we? When we're, when we do, we yeah. Away. We try and have um, a day out exploring, then a day closer to the caravan, chilling yeah. and walking around, then another day exploring and just alternate it, don't we? We yeah. try to do that. Yeah. Um, but yeah, we've always got that one base uh, and we've, we never move around. No. So this will be completely different. Yeah. So basically that's it so i hope you uh i hope you like the sound of of that obviously we are planning to um post videos up of what we're up to when we're in the motorhome um the various stages of the journey what we like what we don't like about it um vicky's gonna drive it vicky obviously doesn't normally drive what well, normally you've never towed the car i can't can i not on my license i think you can I can think, i yeah it does fall under the weight category but you, you i wouldn't, wouldn't be confident no you. whereas the motorhome I, I can't even drive a car without mounting a curb 
let alone don't say that sort of thing because otherwise Bailey ain't going to let us have it are they oh god you just Sorry. admitted to being a reckless driver. No, 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 no. I am a careful driver. Bailey, if we <laughs> are going to take good care of this motorhome... <laughs> I'll only drive it in a straight line. <laughs> just motorway only. I won't turn any corners or you do can, any reverses. We'll, we'll stop at services. You can take over. Yeah, you can... You can drive to the next services. Yeah, then I'll get out. You can park it. <laughs> Yeah. I'll only go in straight maybe, lines. Maybe you can drive it on the ferry to, to Harris. No, I dare not even drive it onto a ferry. That's what I just said. What? You drive it onto the ferry. No, I dare not even do that. Huh. What if I um like slip the... off or something, go into the sea? Slip off. What if I miss the ramp and we fall into the Is this, you got some sort of cartoon idea of what kind of ferry we're gonna go on or something? It's not like a kid's drawing of a ferry we're going on that you just, you know, just fall off. Like on the top I gear I might challenges. judge it wrong and, you know... You like drive on, on the planks Yeah, when they go on, on the plank. It's like, my, you know, if it was like that, I'd never have a hope in hell, would I? I've got no hand-eye coordination. <laughs> Again, don't admit to that sort of thing. Do you know what I mean? Don't admit to that sort of thing. Um... Oh, yeah. Careful. <laughs> so we're gonna bring we're gonna uh, bring you some some good videos. Hopefully, um, again, yeah. we're not we're not we're not looking to sell it to anyone or anything like that. We're literally just want to share our experience. Yeah, we're gonna share our experience, and that's it. Like we do in all our other videos, where we share our experience of caravanning and what we're gonna do. Nothing's gonna change. It's no. that is how it's gonna be. The difference is we're gonna be in a motorhome. Yeah. So we do have a little name for our for our. Um, do you know about this name? It's probably something I've conjured up, like you know, that's, in my that's own. That's I was looking at you, like what? In my own head. What well, is our name? Well, obviously, it's car at the moment. It's caravan chit chat, isn't it? Yeah, but what is our? What is the name? Are we changing our name or? No. Uh, well, what are we doing then? Caravan chit chat goes motorhoming. It took a lot of thought, man. Oh, a lot of thought. I bet you had loads of sleepless nights over that one, didn't you? Well, I think it's an in it's an ingenious name, isn't it? Caravan Chit Chat goes motorhoming. It's like it's almost like a TV program you'd see on a cartoon ch Channel Five or something, isn't it? Yeah, Celebrity Five go motorhoming or Caravan Chit Chat go motorhoming. <laughs> I've just got that Benny Hill song in my head. <laughs> well, that's, exa that's, that's exactly how it's going to be when we're trying to work out what, every, what, what all the bits do on it. Oh my god! God help us! Or, or, we might not even leave Bristol. <laughs> <laughs> or like, I, I, or I think I drained the the waste, the grey waste, like you know, on the thing. But I've totally misjudged it and dumped it on someone's pitch or something. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> oh dear. Um, yeah. So the dogs are coming with us too. Obviously, um, we wouldn't leave them anywhere. They are. Um, well, we could leave them in Harris, can we? No. What are you saying? Uh, they're they they've told us they're really excited about this. You know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> um, <laughs> No, that so it's going to be absolutely fantastic. What's that um, skylight? Don't know. Um, yeah, so that's all we've got to tell you, really, isn't it? Yeah. It's good news. I hope you agree that it's um, it's good news, and we really do hope that you follow us on the journey, um, and yeah, you enjoy what what we um, what we post and and the videos with it. And if anyone's got any rec recommendations of um, places to go. Um, things to see, things to do. Yeah, more, um, I suppose, more things to see. The problem is we're not going to have that much time, are we, in terms of, you know, like when we go to Bunry, we're going to be there for no, one night, one side and one night the No, if there's anywhere that is like a must-see yeah, or a must-do. Yeah, absolutely, that's um, not too far off that route, you yeah, know. Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, feel free to comment below, <laughs> um, tell us, or drop us a message on Twitter. Um, yeah, let us know. Um, and that's about it, isn't it? Anything so, else yeah. to add? No. Gas bagging quite a bit in this one, isn't you? Me? <laughs> I can't get a word in. Okay, so thank you very much. Thank you very much, everyone. <laughs> I'm rubbish at this. <laughs> thank you very much, everyone. Um, give us a like if you like it. Give us a dislike if you dislike it. No, thumbs down if you dislike it. Again, hope you don't think we're we're selling out to Bailey or anything because we really are not. Um, and you know, I hope you enjoy what we're, what we're going to do. Thank you very much for watching. 
hit subscribe if you haven't already, and we'll see you soon. Bye! <laughs> Bye!